What's up Transformers fans, this is Stan Stewart and this is part 3 of the um, Toy Fair 2017. Now they have revealed the set of pictures again for the um, toys we got yesterday. But this time it's just they got a white background and pretty you can have a, like a better look of a yeah, closer look or what they look like. So um, I'll, so I'll, let's get started with it. Now I'm going to do them in their different classes they are. So I'm going to start off with Dragon Storm. And he's a turbo changer. And according to me, he's like a one step change. So that looks pretty interesting. Oh, but when I do, I'm good. Some of the characters, I'm going to go into details what they look like. Some of them, I'll just, just say like the, the color's different. So just have a look out for that. Now, back onto Dragonstorm. Now, Dragonstorm, the design of him in robot form, you got his body, it's like a, a look of a rib K, a rib. So that's what it is. The middle of the body, he's got like a red gem or diamond, whatever you can say. That's what he's got there. Um, on his um, legs, on the knees of his legs, he's got like a padded um, armor on it. And it's got like seven spikes on that. His feet are free, have three toes and like three claws. Uh, now on the shoulders of his arms, they look, they got, he's got like a battle armor on them. And they do look pretty cool. His hands, they look cool. Now with the fingers... Um, to me, they look like he's gonna have claws in the end on these um thing on the bits here, but I I am pretty sure. But that'll be cool if he does. Now the tail is at the back of his um back of the wobble form, but um, I don't know if we'll actually have that in the actual movie. But if he doesn't, then it doesn't mind with him. Maybe he can you know have him out when he wants to fly in his wobble form. Um, the head, the head looks menacing. I can't really tell from the picture I got here, like what it looks like. But I'll tell you now. To from what I can see, it looks like menacing. And his weapon, um, the weapon, it's like a hook sword, you can say, for these um weapon. And it's like a, part of it. It's a tail, but it can't, it comes like a weapon as well. So that looks pretty cool. Now moving on to Megatron, as a, the Legion class, and I'll be talking about the Voyager one as well. But I want to get this one out of the way first. So as part of these jet mode, uh, you can actually, in the front of it, you can open the cone up and it reveals his cannon weapon and you can put, you know when I spoke about the flame, you can add onto his cannon. You can do the same when he's in his vehicle mode. So that looks pretty cool. And also, in the, as the leader, in the leader class one, still talking about the leader class, you can actually, there's a bit when his mouth, it's become like a battle armor mouth. But the one bit that's not, that's missing there is, yeah, you got the horns, but the horns ain't moved to what we saw in the concept art. So I am wondering if you can do that, but if you don't, then it doesn't matter really. At least on here, you've got like a battle mask there to cover it. But well, that's what it looks like, but we just had to wait to see when the toy comes out for you guys. Now, this, I want to talk about the Voyager one, and the Voyager's got a lot of difference. And I'll compare, and I'll tell you the difference to the leader one as well. So Voyager... Voyager, it's color, it's got like that dark is, um, dark is, um, black. It, look, it looks like black, really. Or like a blacky silver, I don't know what you can say. The leader class one's like a sil like a dark, like a silver. Uh, he's still got the same Cybertron, Cybertronian look, you know, in his form, Cybertronian jet form. But it's just the size, you know, because the Voyager and leader, so they're different. Um, the cannon is the very different. Voyager's got a small one. Leader class has got bigger. His sword, it's like a silver on the Voyager. The leader class, it's got silver on it, but in the middle of the weapon, it's like gold. Uh, the mouthpiece, like the actual mouth, the Voyager's got like gold on it. The leader class is doesn't. And that's where really I could spot different on that. Oh, also the feet, also the legs, I mean. The legs, very different to the leader class one. So Voyager and leader class have different look of, of legs. So that's that one. Now Hound. Hound's got a pretty difference. Now I can't compare I'm not really gonna compare him to his age of extinction one because he's got a different vehicle mode, but the body's very different. Now it looks like they improved the body a little bit. It's like uh, the bot the body bit. Now it's a like that biggest one, the biggest body as in the film, um sadly, but it, luckily they have added it like it, they have got that pack he's got on the front of him, you know, like when he he hells all his grenades, he's um like his mini knife or whatever you can call it, whatever he puts it there. He's got that got that look on it. 
He's got some new weapons, as I spoke in the last video. Now, the one that spotted me is his um, feet. Now, the feet, they have me it's like two t tires on the, uh, well, two wheels on the in his vehicle mode. It's like the one's like the middle and the, well, let's say it's just like the two tires become like a foot. And I don't really like that because in the movie version, it's like his tires can be, uh, be do become like three toes. So I'm not really happy about that. And with his vehicle mode, it does look pretty cool. Oh, and one last thing is, on top of his um, helmet, he's got like the ambulance sign on there, so that's different. Now, Scorn, and this one's a Voyager one, so the difference to the Deluxe Age of Extinction one is, the Voyager's got like pointy spikes, um, it's got, well, the other di the difference is he's got an extra two, um, oh, there's pointy things in his back, the spine, that's it, because the Deluxe only had one. Uh, the age extinction one and the tail this time like nearly to the end of the tail you can move it the i mean in the deluxe age of things one you can move the tail but it was like you only could just move the one bit of it and what else is different uh the only difference is it's, because it's a voyager it's a big size so that's different it's got the same paint color but the deluxe one the deluxe one had another color added to it and it was that orange color so that's the only difference i can see on that now we're moving to Deluxes, and <coughs> oh, excuse, excuse me. I want to start off with this Bumblebee toy. And now, this ain't the Bumblebee toy that we have seen from the last couple of weeks. That's the wee paint of the Age of Extinction one. No, they have revealed the Transformers Five version of Bumblebee, and this this is really good. Now, I'm happy that they have revealed that there is going to be a Transformers Five version of Bumblebee. You know, the 2017. Um, car version he's got, I think it's 2017, and I'll tell you now, it does look good. Vehicle mode, it look, looks alright for the toy. The wobble form for the toy looks awesome. It's got that movie accurate. Um, it has that movie accurate look. Uh, the legs, uh, not that much. Well, to me, it doesn't, but okay, for that, I would say, uh, maybe 80% of movie accurate look he has. And also, on his one arm, he's got a cannon. And the other, hand, other arm is just like a hand, you know, just a proper hand with fingers. Well, an arm and, you know what I mean. The head's got a movie accurate, so that looks pretty cool. And the chest got movie accurate, so that's all I can say on that one. Now, we already spoke about Grimlock, but they released a newer picture of him. Crosshairs, only difference I said in the last, I've only said about in the last one, he's got, you know, his colours like a lighter green, excuse me, for this one. Um, Slash, we spoke about him. Um, Drift, as I already said, it's um, he's got red, um, he's got black on them. Um, the swords are black this time. And the vehicle, it's just a different vehicle he's got. So I've only said about that in the last one. Slug, I only said about him in this version. He's got a gold and the kind of like that bluish silver colour. Uh, now, here's the new, new character I was surprised about. And I do want to talk about a bit. And it's, this one is called... Steel Bane, the one I spoke about yesterday a bit. Now, I've been thinking after that, I've been trying to think, what kind of a world does this creature have? And to me, I'm thinking of, is it like someone who used to work with Dragonstorm and then betray him? Or is he like who's a nemesis to Dragonstorm? But that's what I'm thinking of. Now, I'm wondering if he'll make it, a, if this one, this character, Steel Bane, will make an appearance in the past scene. And then he'll be in the present, but I can't pretty say yet, but we don't know. Now, the, the Wobbled form looks good. He's got, like, an arm, paddy armor on the shoulders. He's got, like, the wings as part on the on the back. And he's got a good sword. Um, the body looks awesome. Legs look cool. Now, the head does look awesome. He's got, like, that knight kind of helmet. Well, in his, um, di well, in the Wobbled kind of helmet look. The dragon form's good. Um, the wings are, like, a part of his arm. So that looks pretty awesome. Uh, the head, it's like a, he's got a long neck and the head looks awesome. It's got like pointy ears. The tail looks a bit cool. And in the end of the tail, it's got like a spot, pointy spike and extra spikes to it. That's pretty much all I'll say about him. Or she, I don't know what it is yet. Swoop, I only say about Swoop, he's got like just different colors. Uh, squeaks, now Squeaks, he's got a good bit. Good both forms. Now his wobble form I like. 
He's like, you can have his, you got two wheels and his legs. And now the arms, now on this one side, he's got like a proper arm and he's holding a gun. And the other side, it's like a handle. So that looks pretty awesome. Now he comes with a, like a backpack to his vehicle. And it opens up like he got like, he's probably, he's probably got like missiles and uh, like a laser weapon. And he got this red box. I don't know what that's supposed to be, but looks pretty awesome. Um, but, uh, but then in part of his vehicle mode, it, it turns into like a, like a carrier kind of thing to add onto the vehicle. So that looks pretty cool. And I'll tell you now, his bike form does look good. And that's it really, guys. Uh, that's all I just had to say in that. That's all the pictures I'm going to talk about today. So, you want to see the pictures, they'll be down on me, Transformers Facebook page. That's down in the description below. Um, after you've had a look at them, uh, leave me comments below. What do you think of the figures? Do you like the looks of them? Are you going to buy them? And also, what do you think of the Bumblebee one? Please leave a comments about that as well. Also, give me the thumbs up. Uh, share this out to your friends so I can get more viewers and subscribers. And if you're new, this is what I do. I do Transformers and Marvel Cinematic Universe news. With it, I do trailer and TV spots reactions to them. Uh, when it comes to three weeks before the film, I know they tend to release like spoiler TV spots, so I don't do those. And uh, what else? Oh, I'm trying to think what else I had to say. Oh, yeah. Uh, if you want to see me last Transformers video, click here. Jump to my channel and click the bell so you can... So you can be first to know me videos been up, me new ones. So just click here and click to my channel. And there you can click to see me last Marvel video. So that's it really guys. That's all I've got to say in this video. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching and see you guys soon. Peace.